Christian Bale has recalled meeting Donald Trump while filming The Dark Knight Rises and says the future president treated him like he was Bruce Wayne. The actor was speaking on the red carpet for the premiere of political comedy Vice, in which he plays former Vice President Dick Cheney, where he revealed he was invited up to his office in Trump Towers during filming on the 2012 sequel. We were filming on Batman in Trump Tower and he said, come on up to the office, Bell told Variety. I think he thought I was Bruce Wayne because I was dressed as Bruce Wayne. So he talked to me like I was Bruce Wayne and I just went along with it, really. It was quite entertaining. He continued, I had no idea at the time that he would think about running for president. Bale, who is no stranger to a body transformation for film roles, explained how he consulted a nutritionist for the weight gain required for Vice as opposed to winging it like he did for 2004 film The Machinist which saw him lose 63 pounds. Shortly after, he piled back on 100 pounds for the role of the caped crusader in 2005 film Batman Begins. This is the first time I actually did go to a nutritionist cause I'm starting to feel my mortality, he said. I did decide, you know what, I might die, so maybe I should go to see someone who actually knows what they're talking about instead of just winging it which is what I've always done. Vice has become an awards frontrunner in the past month. It generated positive feedback following its first screening in November, and earned six Golden Globe nominations last week, establishing it as an Oscar Best Picture favorite alongside the likes of Roma and A Star is Born. The film co-stars Amy Adams, Sam Rockwell and Tyler Perry, and sees Bell reunite with the big short director Adam McKay. In recent years, Bell has openly criticized his performance in the Dark Knight trilogy, admitting he didn't quite manage what, he hoped, he would with the role. It'll be released in the UK on January 25, a month after its US release date.